everyone. Lots of football fans will be firing up the grill for this weekend's big playoff games. She's very excited. <laughs> yes, she really I is. Am. And for another Dallas Cowboy fan, a very important custom built barbecue pit was stolen this week. Our Trayson Bragg has more. This Sunday, the Dallas Cowboys are gearing up to play a big playoff game against the Green Bay Packers. But unfortunately, one of their biggest fans is missing his favorite piece of Cowboys memorabilia. David Martinez says his father-in-law's custom-built Cowboys barbecue pit was stolen early Tuesday morning. It was in the backyard of the family's home in La Blanca. The pit is valued at over $3,000. So it's not a regular barbecue pit. We had a customized Cowboys logo on the top of the barbecue pit and also on the smoker. It says Cowboys on both of them. And I mean, he custom built that, you know. And how long have you guys had the barbecue? Uh, exactly one year. He says his father-in-law, who didn't want to appear on camera, lived on this property his entire life. The thief stole not only a barbecue pit, but a family tradition. My father-in-law, we gather here every Sunday for every, you know, playoff, regular season game to playoff game, especially right now, you know, the playoffs. Martinez and his father-in-law ran to a neighbor's home to check their surveillance cameras as soon as they discovered their pit was stolen. My father-in-law's sister, actually, she's our neighbor, and she has cameras surrounding her house. It went straight to the cameras. They saw it. The getaway vehicle was a teal-colored Chevy truck. The burglars were caught on tape. Martinez and his father-in-law filed a report with the Hidalgo County Sheriff's Department. Deputy Jose P. Rodriguez says a rise in the number of these types of crimes are taking place in the La Blanca area. In this particular particular area where the theft occurred, um, there, there there is sometimes an increase in, in property crimes, which includes uh, thefts and burglaries. And, and the way to defeat that is by working together uh, with the people that we serve. Mr. Martinez says that this is a piece of the tail light from the burglar's vehicle. He says he believes that they damaged their vehicle when they were loading the barbecue pit onto the truck. For us, the big thing is they can come back and do it again. They did this, they were comfortable to do it. So who knows, they can come right back and do it, you know, to the next neighbor or to the one after that, you know what I mean? When I asked Martinez why he decided to call Channel 5, he had this to say. There's other people that have gotten, you know, things worse out there, man, but this is, you know what I mean, something that my, my father-in-law, I know he shares so much, he loves so much, that's something, you know what I mean, he liked, and we just, you know, for justice just to be served, man, so not to happen to somebody else. You can help when things like this happen in your neighborhood. Call 956-668-8477. In the studio, I'm Trayson Bragg at Channel 5 News at 6.